Hi, I'm James, and in this video I'm once again taking a look at Grand Theft Auto 5 on Intel HD 5500 graphics. We can see here we are using the latest 4170 revision drivers, same settings as before, um, and whereas previously we were seeing a lot of graphical corruption in the sky where it wasn't rendering properly, uh, with these latest drivers, which are Wickle approved and all the rest, um, we can see in a moment once the test loads that the corruption that we were experiencing in the sky has now gone. Uh, so running on Broadwell based platforms, so HD 5300, 5500, 6000, um, 6100 on say a MacBook, uh, or MacBook Pro, sorry. Um, the game will now render correctly. Um, compared to say HD 4400 on Haswell based products we're still seeing lower performance so clearly there's still some work for Intel to do on these drivers to get Broadwell working well with Grand Theft Auto 5 but at least now the game is rendering correctly and no doubt with future driver revisions we should see some performance improvements to maybe get this up to around 30 frames per second and get it playable on HD 5500 base chips. I hope you found this video useful and be sure to subscribe and we'll be checking with the latest driver releases to see for performance improvements uh, with Grand Theft Auto on uh, HD 5500 and also check out our other videos we've been testing this game and others across a wide range of graphics solutions. Thanks for watching.